What is up my beautiful Marmars and welcome back. Today we're doing candy sushi versus real sushi. All right, for the candy sushi, I'm gonna make my own with this yummy nummy sushi set with candy sushi. There's a cool candy drink and a, uh, I don't know, I'm just excited to make it. You, know, you guys know how much I love the Japanese versions of these, the popping cooking, but I'm doing the American one today. And for the real sushi, we have this right here, look at this is real sushi guys. This is not boba, that's not boba. These are salmon eggs. This is some real fish right here. Here we go. All right, we're gonna see which one's better. Let's find out, let's find out, let's do it. Okay, here we go. So I'm gonna open the box up right now. Bam. Okay, I have these trays. This here. All right, so we have the instructions, the trays, these powders that turn it into candy sushi like magic. This is my favorite part of making these. The candy just like appears before your eyes with just a little bit of water. All right, for the first step, you're gonna wanna cut off this molded pack right here and just keep that separated because you'll need it later, but just not right now. So you can just cut it out. Okay, great. Now we're gonna grab our rice packet right here. Cut it open. And I'm gonna take eight round scoops of rice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then I'm gonna take one and a half square scoops of water. One whole scoop right here for man, and then a half scoop. Oh, oh a little bit more. Come on, baby. Okay, here we go. Half scoop. And you want to get your super cute spoon right here, just mix it all together. No, hey, no, get back in there. Bad rice powder mix. This is so uh, therapeutic to just mix these little mini things together. <laughs> so this is supposed to be rice. It's gonna make rice, guys. You just have to believe and get all the water mixed into it. Okay, I can see it starting to happen. Come on, rice. Come on. After the rice is thoroughly mixed in together, you can just let it sit now while you make the rest of your ingredients. All right, so we're gonna take our fish packet right here. Cut that open. And we're gonna get our handy dandy scooper again. And I'm gonna need about three round scoops of it into tray number two. So, one, two, three. Then I'm gonna grab four scoops of square water. One, two, three, four. Now we mix. Immediately after you mix this right here, you wanna get your fish mold and get that ready because you're gonna fill it up. So, here we go. Now I wanna go ahead and put it into my molds. All right, so now I'm gonna go put this in the fridge for about 10 minutes. All right, the next two steps are pretty similar, so I'm gonna do them at the same time. See these four trays right here, four and five? There's a fill line. So I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to fill it with, oh, I knew this was gonna be difficult. Oh, yep, okay. Filling it up. Now, I'm gonna go to the second one. Get the fill line on there. Okay, all right, so now we have our packets. This one says eggs. So, we wanna go ahead and cut this open. And we wanna take one big scoop of this, one round scoop of eggs. There's not that much in here, okay. So that's one round scoop. I'm gonna put that into number four. Bam. All right, so I'm gonna mix the egg powder directly into the water. I just wanna make sure it's thoroughly mixed. Come on, mix, mix, mix. There's still some particles, but I just don't want it to go to the other side. Don't jump. Do not jump, you eggs. For number five, we're gonna use two scoops of egg base. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab this right here. One, two. Now I'm gonna clean my dirty little spoon here. Okay, cleaning him up. Yeah, nice and clean. Okay, now we want to mix all this powder directly into the water, and it's starting to get all nice in there. Mmm, it smells kind of good. So these, this one smells like orange soda. This one doesn't really smell like anything. This one smells like orange soda, though. That's really exciting. Ah. Apparently, it wants me to do number four and put it in number five. Okay, so you get a dropper like this. Just suck up some of number four. Gonna drop into number five. Whoa, 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 whoa. The eggs are appearing in front of my eyes right now. What is going on? What is this witchcraft? What? 
This is so sick. Whoa, 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 I'm doing multiple. Oh, I made a string. I didn't mean to do that. I inked. I got a little too excited. I meant to just make these little balls. I guess the closer you get to, you can make better balls. You can just make so many. Just drop, 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 drop. This is so satisfying to make. I think we're ready to make sushi now. All right, so remember our rice from tray number one? We're gonna take that and separate it into three equal parts. Looks about equal to me, so I'm gonna put it there. This looks equal right about there. And then we're gonna take them and shape them into our, the sushi pieces we want them to be. Did you guys know that professional sushi chefs, when they're cooking, they know that there's like a hundred grains of rice in their hand when they're making it? All right, now that we have our rice here, we got our fish from the fridge. I'm gonna go ahead and pop these bad boys out. Ooh, oh, what? It's like a nice jelly. Ooh, look at it. It's so pretty. And then we can just fold it. Oh, okay, I'm gonna put it there for now. I'm gonna get the other ones here. So I got my other fishy right here. This one kind of looks like a big cut of Spam. Shout out to Hawaii or the Filipinos. I don't know what Spam looks like. Then I'm gonna put the last piece right on this one. Beautiful looking sushis right here. And then we're missing our final ingredient right now, which are the baby fish eggs. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab some, place them on top right here. These fish eggs are a lot Harder to capture than I thought. Well, at least the pretty ones are. There's like so many ugly ones. Like that one's kind of ugly, but it looks okay right there when they're all clumped up together. Ooh, this is so cool. This makes me feel awesome. Mmm, look at my candy sushi. We have some yellow tail. We have one that looks like a fish. All right, so they gave us a little soda cup. I'm gonna take the cup. Put it in the water just like that. Okay, maybe not that full. There we go. There's all my water right there, okay? So now, we're gonna put my water right there and you guys ready for this witchcraft right here? Okay, here we go. I'm gonna take my soda packet right here and you get one scoop of soda. Ooh, okay. Ooh, it's already starting to foam. It's fizzing. Whoa, whoa, we got some pink soda. <laughs> Look at this. Do you hear that? It's foaming. It's like real soda. You guys know how much I love soda. All right, so now I'm gonna try to recreate these yummy nummies right here in real life. So I have some yellowtail right here. I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of them. One, two, and three. There we go. So I cleaned off the yummy nummy spoon and I'm gonna go ahead and grab some of these little baby fish eggs right here. Put it onto my yellow tail. Grab some more fish eggs. Bloop. 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 So we recreated the yummy nummy sushi right here. Look how beautiful that is. And now I have to recreate that soda. So, right here I have this pink soda. Hopefully it looks the same. I'm hoping, fingers crossed here. Let's pour it out. Oh, oh gosh, I've never seen a soda do that before. <laughs> what the heck? How did I even do that? This is the first time I've ever opened a soda like this. What? Here we go. <gasps> it is pink. Yeah, ooh. <laughs> There we go, baby. We have the real life food right here versus the yummy nummies candy sushis play set right here. Now, it's time to do a taste test. So I have my real food right here, and I think this is what we're gonna try first because I, I, you know, I love sushi, I love pink drinks, and I'm really hungry right now. So let's go ahead and try this one. Here we go. Uh huh. <laughs> oh my gosh! This sushi is like four days old. <laughs> my eyes are watering because I put it in my mouth, and it tastes like really fishy, like really old and fishy and like the bubbles all popped in my mouth and it just tastes like a nasty ocean in your mouth. I'm gonna try a little bit more if I can. Just a tiny bit more just to make sure it wasn't the worst thing. Uh, 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 oh, it smells so fishy now that I took a bite of it. This is terrible cheap sushi. Don't invest in cheap sushi or else this will happen to you too. I'm gonna try to wash it down with this pink soda and see if this is good. Oh, okay, this pink soda is really good though. Okay, that made me feel better about everything about life. All right, now it's time to try the candy sushi right here. 
That smells good. That smells good. Please don't be fishy. Please don't be fishy. Please don't be fishy. I'm gonna grab the fish one and hope it's not fishy. Okay, here we go. That's not that bad. Okay. The rice still tastes like really nasty, but the gummy jelly and the, and the eggs taste good to me. Mm, mm. I can eat that all day, but the rice, the rice tastes really weird. I don't know if I like the rice. Oh, it's like, it wants to be a gum, but it dissolves. I don't know. Mmm, <laughs> this one just tastes like strawberries and butterflies. Mmm. Hands down, favorite part of the sushi, though, is definitely the popping boba stuff on top right here. Mmm, the fish eggs. Mmm. Mmm, slurped it right up. Look at that. Yummy. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, and then I'm gonna go ahead and try the photo. Oh! Describe it. I would give this some leeway if this was the Japanese version like oh, that's the flavors They like in Japan, but this is the American version. It should not taste like this All right, so to summarize the winners of this is the candy sushi But the real life soda definitely beat the candy soda real life soda Mm -mm. So much better, delicious, grapefruity. I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video where I did candy sushi versus real life sushi. Give this video a big thumbs up if you guys love sushi, soda, and pink things. And I'll see you guys tomorrow at 12 p.m. for another new video. 